Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Pro Media back with another Dokkan Battle video. And today, I'm gonna show you guys a way to find out the exact release time of any new upcoming unit or event or banner, no matter where you live in the world or what time zone you're in. And this video was really inspired by just the sheer number of questions that people have asked me on my streams and video comments about when a new unit or event or banner was gonna come out. And while I really don't mind the questions, I just think it's gonna be much easier and more efficient for people to find out for themselves in the future. So the way we're gonna get this done is by using and taking full advantage of the wonderful tool that is the Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle Wiki. And I'll provide a link to it in my description down below for those of you that aren't too sure how to access it. Um, you can also actually just Google like Dokkan Battle Wiki, but um, this should be a little bit easier for you. So once you guys get to the website, you're going to see the main page, which is what's on the screen right now. Of course, it's zoomed in like crazy right now because I want you guys to see exactly what's going on. So when you get there, it might look, you know, a little bit different, but don't worry about it too much. So we're here on the main page right now. And if you scroll down just a little bit, it's going to start with the current event or campaigns that are happening on both versions of the game. So as you can see on global right now, we have the get up and go super growth campaign with the energetic little boys and girls. <laughs> and uh, there's also a countdown here as well for when the event or campaign actually ends. So for the global campaign, it ends in eight days, five hours, 32 minutes, and you know, the seconds are counting down of course. And for JP, they currently have the full throttle rainy season campaign part one, and that ends in 18 days, 20 hours, 32 minutes, and 25 seconds. Now I believe this countdown or this time actually includes part two of the celebration as well. So um, this should change very soon in like the next like day or two, I'd say. Um, so that's, you know, the current campaigns that are going on. And if you go down just a little bit more, uh, it's going to start with actually the new release cards. I forgot to change the tab back, but it should have the current new cards on both versions to start. And on global right now, we have the Int Kid Goku, his SSR form, uh, Tech Master Roshi, STR Demon King Piccolo, as well as LR Goku and Arale as the new cards. And on JP right now, they have the uh, Int Buhan Extreme Z Awakening. We have the Namek Transforming Goku, or sorry, Namek Transforming Goku, and also the AGL Final Form Frieza, as well as the new Free to Play Second Form Frieza 2. And of course, those will change as well once uh, more units come out, right? But I think the thing that most of you guys clicked on this video for and are really interested in finding out about is how do you know when a new unit is coming out or like when exactly it's going to be coming out, right? And all you have to do for that one is just click on the upcoming cards tab beside the new release cards. So we're going to click on that and it shows you the release time and also a countdown for the exact release like moment it releases for all cards on both Global and JP. I mean, at least the cards that we know about, right? So for JP right now, we know that the next new card is gonna be the LR Full Power Frieza, right? And as you can see, the release date here is June 13th, 2019, but it can be a little bit confusing for a lot of people because there are Dokkan players all over the world, right? And people live in different time zones. So um, they made it a lot easier basically by giving us a countdown here as well. So as you can see at the time of this filming, the LR Frieza is coming out in 13 hours, 31 minutes, and 28 seconds. Or, you know, it, it, the seconds don't matter. Don't worry about that. But, um, of course, when you guys watch this video, it's going to be even lower than that. And uh, it's just super helpful because, you know, when you give people a time, they have to convert it between from, like, their uh, time zone to, you know, the JP time. But with this website here... No matter where you are, no matter where you live, no matter what time zone you're in, it will tell you the exact time to the release and uh, just make it a lot less confusing for people. So here is the Frieza as well as his uh, TUR form and base form. And then for Global right now, the only one we know about, the only new unit, I guess, technically unit um, that's coming out is the Extreme Z Awaken form of the Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. And that's coming out on June 14th or one day, 12 hours. Uh, zero minutes and 38 seconds from now, right? So super, super useful feature, guys. Like, I, <laughs> to be honest, I only found out about these countdowns recently, and I feel like I should be kind of ashamed of that as a Dokkan content creator, but as I always like to say, better late than never, right? So um, at least I know about it now, and I can share it with you guys, and uh, hopefully this will help some of you out there who, you know, used to struggle to know exactly when something was coming out. So that's for the upcoming cards. And if you go down even further, 
they have a feature for current and upcoming events as well. So it's going to start with the current events. And as you can see, these are the current events that are on global at the moment with the associated countdowns at the bottom as well. So we have all these you know, Dragon Ball events, um, Ultimate Clash as well ends in 11 days, and uh, so on and so forth. And then same thing for JP2. All the current events that are on JP right now are shown here. Or at least the events that are, I think, part of the current campaign, right? So they're all listed there. And then if you go to the upcoming event, so this is the first tab is going to be for global. And we can see that the Extreme Z battle for Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks is coming out in one day, 11 hours and 59 minutes. Um, and for the Ghostly Prank or Ghost Tanks event, that's coming out at the same time. And same thing with the uh, Galactic Crisis event as well with the Bojack and Gohan. One day, 11 hours, 59 minutes. And then if you go even further beyond that, it also shows the release times of some events that aren't even announced in the game yet. As you can see, we got the Battle of Gods event coming back, the Dragon Ball Super Universe 6 Saga event coming back, and so on and so forth. And these are all coming in eight days, 11 hours and 57 minutes, or June 21st. And this will be basically part of the little filler celebration between our current celebration on Global and the four year anniversary stuff. And this is also why a lot of people out there, especially um, Kawaii on Twitter, think that we're probably going to be getting the uh, featured LR Beerus banner as part of this mini celebration. So there we go, guys. That is for the upcoming events. And if you go over to the JP side, it actually says no upcoming events at the moment because we don't know about any events that are coming up. But I'm sure this will change very, very soon as more information about part two of the uh, Namek event comes out as well. So stay tuned for that. Obviously, check it for yourself if you're interested. And um, there's also some filters for the daily events as well as uh, filtering by type. So all the AGL events will tell you exactly when those are coming out. Tech, Int, STR, Physical, and also Extreme and Super. So just a super, like extremely, extremely useful tool. And uh, you guys should definitely take advantage of it. If you were one of those people that always wondered, when is this event coming out? Or when is that event coming out? Now you'll know, right? And now the last thing I want to show you guys at the bottom here is for the current and upcoming banners or summons. And it has the information for both Global and JP. As you can see on Global right now, we have the Youth Category banner as well as the Int Kid Goku banner along with the associated countdown at the bottom here which tells you exactly when the banner is going to go away which is going to be super helpful for those of you who maybe need to save up stones but don't want to miss out on a specific banner. Now you know um, exactly when a banner is going to go away. So both of these banners are going to be gone in 10 days, 11 hours and 22 minutes. And as far as the JP side goes, we got the uh, Namek Goku banner. We have you know some other stuff as well, some category summons and stuff like that. And uh, you know also the countdown at the bottom here to tell you when it's going to go away. So if you guys haven't pulled this Goku yet and you still really want him, you have five days and around 13 hours from the time this video is released. And then if you click on the upcoming summons tab here, it will show you the release times for all the known banners that are coming to both Global and JP. And as you can see for JP right now, the only banner we know is coming is the legendary summon banner for the LR full power Frieza. And the banner image is currently question marks because nobody really knows what the banner is going to be composed of. But what we do know is that it's coming out on June 13th and that's going to be in 13 hours, 17 minutes and X number of seconds right there. And for global, we have the upcoming Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks Extreme Z banner, which is going to be dropping in one day, 11 hours and 47 minutes, which is the same time as the Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks Extreme Z battle event. And also, of course, the unit itself. And lastly, we have this rare summon weekend ticket banner uh, that's coming out in two days, five hours and 16 minutes. And by the way, for those of you watching this video, while this weekend summon event is still a thing, don't spend your tickets until the last weekend, all right? Because they might do the same thing as last time and make only the final banner double rates, whereas the other banners are all regular rates. So to avoid getting screwed over like that, like a lot of people did last time, myself included, just save up those tickets and see what they do, all right? So <laughs> that's pretty much gonna do it for today's video, guys. I hope you guys found it helpful. And uh, like I said in the future, when new you know hype events or hype banners or anything like that are announced, you guys can just go to this website here, the Dokkan Battle Wiki, and find out for yourself exactly when the unit or banner or event is gonna come out. All right, so that's all I really gotta say. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And as always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, 
you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all of my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I appreciate every single one of you. Hope you guys have a fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.